If you want to learn best strategies on Amazon advertising and leverage your competitor listings to get more sales, then watch this video. Hey guys, how are you doing? I'm Ankita Nagraj from Seller App. Up until recently, Amazon only allowed keyword-centric ad campaigns, but with its new update, you can also target categories and products. With just a little bit of work and planning, you can increase your market share, your sales, improve your relevance, and reach out to more potential buyers just by targeting your competitive brands and products. Let's take a look at some of the best strategies to advertise on your competitor's listing. But before that, let's have a look at how to choose the right competitors to target. You can find the right ASINs from organic search results, sponsored ads, and brand analytics. Organic search. You can focus on the products that are ranking at the top of the page on organic search results. You can target their brand-specific keywords or product-specific keywords in manual uh, targeting campaigns. Amazon sponsored ads. Find brands that are pumping money into Amazon sponsored ads. Sponsor products that appear at top of search on page one are a great way to increase your impressions and consequently your sales. Amazon Brand Analytics. This is the best source for sellers and vendors to choose ASINs from. They can use this feature to reap more profits and utilize their ad budget to the maximum. It has valuable insights into customers and competitors. Potential insights can be found in Market Basket Analysis, Amazon Search Term Report within Brand Analytics, and Item Comparison and Alternate Purchase Behavior. Not only do they deliver insights into competitors, but they also deliver insights into customer shopping behavior. Use Customer Search Term Report and again within Brand Analytics to find top 5 competitors with highest clicks, and conversion rate for any given search term. If you find that the conversion rate is lower than the CTR, then you have a clear winner. So you can define your strategies based on competitor and customer data. But there is a catch. The catch is to target the right ASINs. So what are these right ASINs? You need to target competitors that give you a clear competitive advantage. So um, you can target the ASINs that are inferior to you in one or more of the following areas. The first is price. Choose products that are priced higher than yours. The second is reviews and ratings. Obviously choose products that have lower reviews and lower ratings. And the third one is listing. Choose products that have lower or inferior listing quality than yours. Another great way to choose ASINs would be to use Seller PPC Analyzer. You can identify top performing ASINs with high sales and at a lower A cost from the uh, PPC Analyzer Insight section. All you have to do is uh, open your account, go to PPC Analyzer on the left hand menu and go to Insight section. And in the positive ASINs, you'll see all the ASINs where you've got sales and uh, low A cost populate in the positive ASIN section. Now comes the main part. Let's talk about how to set up manual campaigns to advertise on your competitors' listings. There are three ways to go about it. You can set up keyword targeting manual campaigns, product targeting manual campaigns, and category targeting manual campaigns. ASIN targeting. Now, pick the top performing ASINs for your primary keywords and make it into a list. Now, import this list in your manual ASIN targeting campaign to advertise on your competitors' listings. Brand targeting within a category. While you're targeting category, uh, we recommend you not to stop at selecting a category at the top level, but instead go levels deeper into the category. It would also help if you choose filters based on price range, reviews, and ratings. Now, you can also specify a brand, but choose a brand that's getting decent amount of traffic. The last one is keyword targeting. You could either target brand-specific keywords or keywords that are unique to the product. For example, you can target keywords such as ASICS running shoes or Gel Venture running shoes, which is uh, pretty much unique to ASICS. And you can also specify model number. This way, anybody that's, that's searching for ASICS will see your ad, and if your product is perceived to be better than ASICS, then you'll get sales. CPC tends to be lowest in keyword targeting campaigns compared to ASIN and category. That makes it the most converting campaign and the second most converting would be ASIN and then comes category. If you start getting consistent clicks 
in the sponsored product section of your competitor's listing. You can end up in the customers who viewed this item also viewed section for free. In the long run, this increases your organic traffic and visibility and therefore sales. Effective use of these strategies can increase your market share with a low acquisition cost. Manual targeting campaigns can be a little tedious with multiple campaigns running at the same time and you have to constantly optimize it and you may take it may take a while to see the results but it's definitely worth it. So that's all for today guys. Let's meet again with another great video. Please do give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more great content.